Paulette on Five Eyes TV and I'm just about to go and speak with Theo Chambers at Witter Village. Hi Theo, how are you? Fantastic. Gosh, you're looking Fantastic. good. How do you feel? From 1 to 10, how about a 20? <laughs> Doing extremely well. That's excellent. And you guys, oh my, it's a long time I haven't seen you I and know, your husband. I know, I know. We miss Reggae Sunfest, Jamaica Jazz and Blues. I know. But oh know my what? goodness. The time will come again. Yes. I understand you've written another book. Yes, I did. Right, can you tell me a little, called a little bit about this book? Called Theorism. Theorism is a way of life. Yeah. It was one day I woke up and the ancestors just came down on me and told me write this book and I just keep on writing and this is the result of it. The title? Yes. Tell me, what made you go for that title? Well, as you know, my middle name is Theophilus. And when I think about Frank Sinatra, that he said, I did it my way with a song. <laughs> <laughs> I thought about writing something about theorism, my belief, my ideology, my philosophy of life. Right. And that's what it's all about. And it's based on the principle that I personally believe that we are integrated seamlessly with nature and the cosmic world. And when you look at that BMW, an example, you see an automobile. Yeah. But the automobile cannot function without the engine and all the electrical parts. When I look at you, myself, we see a physical body. But we all are locked into this thing called a brain that's like four, four pounds, four and a half pounds. We live in this brain. We do not live in a house. We do not live in a car. We live 24-7 in this body. And many of us know how to maintain our car, what type of gas to put inside the car, when to tune it up. But we have no idea how to take care of this human engine. <laughs> And to me, that's the problem. Another thing that I learned while writing this book, or at least came to light, is that while we were in our mother womb, we were connected to our mother based on that biblical card that was connected to our neighbor. Can you imagine? Everything that brought you and I into existence mm -hmm. came through our neighbor. Yeah. That's the hub. That's the brain our oxygen, our food, everything, blood, everything came through that neighbor. So when you understand that, we understand that you could be, you could be totally unconscious, but your digestive system, your guts continue to function. Digest your food, everything, every sickness, disease, everything comes from your guts. And once you understand how to maintain your guts, then I think you sort of maintain your healthy life. January 24th, 2021, I'm 72 years old. God. And I try to, to live my, you know, what my goal is. Yeah. I try, my goal is to die young at a very old age. Right. <laughs> and, to <I> do, like <laughs> and to do that, you have to understand how the human body is put together. And Paulette, another thing that I found out, if you and I understand that to create another human being, it got to come from the sperm in a man and the egg of a woman. There's no other way we can put anything together to create another human being. That means that you and I are walking manufacturing, manufacturer of human beings. There, there's nothing else. We, they, you cannot create a sperm nowhere else. You cannot create an egg nowhere else. So we are the only manufacturing environment for that. Right. So going back to this book, yes. does this explain everything? Yes, it explains everything. And it, so an example, whenever a man have an ejaculation, he ejaculates approximately 100,000 sperm in that one ejaculation. But out of those 100,000 sperm, each one of those sperm could, could, could be a dad, have the potential to be a dad. Can you imagine that? So it's all depending which one won yeah. will determine your personality and all of that. So I also learned that when I sit back and in a quiet moment and listen to all the things happening in my head, it's not me. It's all those ancestors speaking to you and I. And it depends which one we listen to 
will determine who we are in this lifetime. Can you read something from the section of your book? Let me... A little, a little passage. Uh, let me see. I'll I read something. Let me find something here. Okay. The introduction. Let me read the introduction. Okay. Yeah. Are you ready to explore the depths of your being as a creator? If you are, you will enjoy reading Theorism. This book will challenge you to acknowledge and become masters of the universe within. The premise of theorism as a lifestyle, not dogma, allows truth to come to the surface when one awakens to the, to the awareness that consciousness is breeding you as part of this divine law. I am because we are Ubuntu. Text on greater meaning. In this conscious awareness, you and humanity are one and cannot be separated. Universal truth is immutable. We either live in harmony or disharmony, thus reaping the benefit of our action. That's just a part introduction. An example, when you and your husband argue, you stimulating very pressure points inside of your body that helps you to live a better life. You feel comfortable, you, you feel, you know, trusted and so forth. So this book, takes you out of the man-made world. An example, let me ask you a couple of quest questions. Who created the oxygen? Who created oxygen? Anybody? Your answer is just as good. Who will you say? Creator. The creator. Who created the cosmos? I'm going to say the creator. Again. Exactly. Okay. Who created human? The creator. All right. Who created the, the, the stock market? Man. Ma good. Who created the automobile? Man. So, we know who created certain things. We know who created, what man created. Don't ask me to go pray to God, the creator, to help me with the stock market. <laughs> because he did not create the stock market. <laughs> Don't ask me to pray to God to help me to get a house. No, I need to learn how to use the stock market to earn money to buy my house. So you see, I don't mix the cosmic law with man-made law. Right. There are two separate laws. And I learned that also because I've never seen a Brinks truck follow any funeral. Uh, I've never seen a Brinks truck, a, a, a money truck, okay. any funeral. Uh -huh. So at the end of the day, we have to really, really understand the power of just enjoying life. Definitely. Where do you live? In the UK. No. No, you live 24-7 in your body. <laughs> and sometimes you stay in, you, in the U, UK. <laughs> so if you live 24-7 in your body, the most expensive thing should go inside of your body, not on top of your body. Because that's where you live, 24-7. If somebody wanted to purchase this book, they can go to the website called Carib Store, C A R I B S T O R E dot com. They can go to CaribStore.com right, and purchase the book, or they can go to Amazon yeah. and just type in Theorism by Theo Chambers and it will pop right up. Okay, and what's the price? The price is $19.95 and the ebook. Yeah. It's twelve dollars and ninety-five cents. Okay, that's excellent. Yes. So you're making sure everybody's covered. Everybody is covered. Excellent. Well, thank you very much, Theo, for sharing. But more than anything else, I need to find out what you and your husband are eating. Y'all never age at all. <laughs> so that's another topic we need to talk about. What are y'all eating, so we can share it with the rest of the world? Yeah, we will do. <laughs> okay, thank you. Thank you so much.